It could erupt at any moment. Watch this massive geyser in Yellowstone. Yellowstone National Park is known for its geothermal wonders, but it's the threats underground that are getting the attention. Events like the Black Diamond Pool explosion and recent seismic activity at Steamboat Geyser remind us that the park is a volatile place. Perhaps the biggest shock of 2024 was the hydrothermal implosion at Black Diamond Pool in Biscuit Basin. The incident sent steam, water, mud and rock several hundred feet into the air, shaking the park and setting off alarms. While no one was injured, the impact of the explosion underscored the random nature of Yellowstone's steam features. The explosions are caused by liquid water turning to steam in substructure pipes and erupting into potentially catastrophic eruptions if people get a little closer. While hydrothermal eruptions like this are common in Yellowstone, the scale of the Black Diamond Pool eruption was extraordinary. Less frequent eruptions with craters up to 10 feet in diameter occur a few times a year and generally go unreported because they occur at night or in the wilderness. This reminds us of Yellowstone's unpredictable power and emphasizes ongoing reporting and preparation at this fascinating site. Prior to the 2024 Black Diamond Pool eruption, Excelsior Geyser in the Midway Geyser Basin was one of Yellowstone's most effective eruption sites. The geyser first became active in the late 1800s, and its eruptions sent water and rock 360 feet into the air, accompanied by huge clouds of steam that could be seen from 100 miles away. The eruptions were so powerful that they produced powerful earthquakes that shook and shattered the geyser's walls with each eruption. The frequency of these eruptions was astonishing, with intervals as short as an hour, and often lasting several minutes. These spectacular displays were powerful enough to cause substantial increases in river flows in the surrounding area, and park officials felt that the geyser deserved the research name, Excelsior, for the sheer magnitude of its eruptions. However, in the late 1800s, the geyser collapsed and went dormant for most of the next century, only briefly reawakening in 1985. Despite relatively few bubbling and small eruptions, Excelsior's activity has been less sporadic in recent years, though it remains unpredictable, like this one, when Yellowstone woke up after 160,000 years. Along with explosive hydrothermal phenomena, Yellowstone's steamboat geyser continues to draw the attention of researchers and the public. The world's tallest geyser has seen increased activity in recent years, with a small eruption expected in December 2024. This has prompted the United States Geological Survey USGS, to put the geyser on high alert, in hopes of avoiding a major eruption in early 2025, officials said. While scientists are monitoring the area, activity at Yellowstone volcanoes is notoriously difficult to predict. While the likelihood of an eruption is unknown, recent increases in seismicity in the region, including 82 earthquakes through December 2024 alone, suggest that geological changes are now occurring on a large scale. The risk of a major volcanic eruption, however, remains low, but it is one of the many things that will appeal to those currently fascinated by the Earth's immense power. Yellowstone remains a hotbed of Earth's thermal activity, like this one where Iceland discovered energy beneath the snow 50 years ago, from the eruptions of Black Diamond Pool to the eruptions of Steamboat Geyser to the historic Excelsior Geyser. While the scale of the eruptions is unknown, these events demonstrate the potentially chaotic and unpredictable nature of the planet. Yellowstone's beauty and wildness are critical to scientific monitoring, and visitors are urged to exercise caution and respect.